I believe that parents should make decisions regarding vaccinations, not government. And last year we had a situation here in the state of New Jersey where there was a new vaccination called the Gardasil vaccination for the human papillomavirus. And there was an effort that all 11-year-old girls in the state of New Jersey, before they could attend school, private or public, would have to get this mandatory vaccination. There was an implication here that all 11-year-old girls are sexually active. I find that rather offensive. Also, this vaccination had never been tested on 11-year-old girls. And by the way, this was the most expensive vaccination in the history of the world. So therefore, there was a lot of money behind the effort to have this law passed in the state of New Jersey. Well, I opposed this effort to pass this new law mandating that all 11-year-old girls had to get the Gardasil vaccination. I didn't think it was appropriate. I thought there were too many open questions about the health implications on our youth. And I'm happy to report that a result, as a result of my efforts, we were able to stop the Gardasil vaccination from being mandated here in the state of New Jersey. Now, if parents want to go ahead and voluntarily get the Gardasil vaccination for their daughters, go ahead. That's fantastic. But that's what America's all about. You can make that choice. But to mandate it for all 11-year-old girls, even for the parents who strongly oppose that, even for 11-year-old girls who clearly are not engaging in sexual activity, I felt it was the heavy-handed influence of government going over the top, and we stopped that, we fought it, and successfully put an end to that effort.